Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Dive into the realm of e-commerce integration as we explore the seamless process of connecting WeCommerce to Etsy. This step-by-step -step guide ensures your product flow effortlessly between platforms, maximizing your reach and streamlining your online business operations. So guys, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you get the full information. So guys, the first thing to do is simply to head up to Etsy.com as you can see right in front of you. Here guys, we should simply create an account or sign in to our existing account that we have already made. So for example, I will just connect to this account as you can see. And there I am connected successfully to my Etsy store. Now, basically the second thing is to make a WooCommerce account or to have a WooCommerce dashboard. Well, when we talk about WooCommerce, what we are talking about is a basically one plugin of major plugins that they exist on uh, WordPress. So when we are talking about WooCommerce, we can't just literally create an account on WooCommerce. That's not going to be it. We have to actually uh, accuse and have a dashboard, a website on WordPress. So as you can see here, I will simply just log in to my uh, dashboard or my account on WordPress, as you can see. So this is my dashboard. Now, as you would literally see in front of you, this is the dashboard. So now in here, all we need to do is to go to the plugins, click on them and make sure to add new. And right through here, we will need to simply download WooCommerce to our WordPress website. The second thing or the third thing is to make sure that your WordPress is up to date. Everything is good on it and it is ready to go. So here I'm going to search for WooCommerce. Here we go. And here, as you can see, I don't have my WordPress website up to date. So what I will have to do is to update the WordPress and update the PHP code of my templates. This is very necessary to actually have WooCommerce downloaded on your own account on your WordPress website. There is another method, which is basically by creating and logging in through your WordPress or your WooCommerce right through uh, WooCommerce itself. So you can continue as that and they will literally take you to your WordPress website. Now, here I am. Uh, this is like the WordPress dashboard. So here there is this way, which is basically by going to extensions and searching for the extension that they have. So here we could simply just search for Etsy as they have here. Or we can, if we didn't find it here, we can search for WooCommerce. Uh, here we go, Etsy integration. And we will find literally here like a blog talking about that and explaining how to do so. And here it is. This is the plugin that you have to download on WooCommerce. Now, this, the thing is, it is not for free. So it will cost you around $20 per month or $21 per month. It's going to be up to $249 per a year. And basically, let's talk about the plugin and what it does and how it can it help you to actually manage to have your uh, integration work between WooCommerce and Etsy and what does this integration give you as an advantage. So here as you could see seamlessly integrate your WooCommerce store with Etsy for a hassle-free selling experience plus effortlessly import Etsy listings into your WooCommerce stores with this solution. So here we have the key features that they exist on this plugin, which is seamless authorization. Gain Swift access with one click authorization to your Etsy store by entering your Etsy shop name through said commerce's Etsy integration extension. There is an efficient bulk management where you can effortlessly upload or update your WooCommerce listings on your Etsy store in bulk. Set separate inventory rules, price them, plans and shipping options and finally listen details simultaneously and there is a hustle free Etsy import which is basically with this integration plugin you can effortlessly import your entire Etsy product catalog into your WooCommerce store in formality across all platforms
and there is all of these like uh, amount of uh, features that are very very helpful that's gonna help you and boost your both your account on Etsy and your own uh, uh, shop on WooCommerce so here for example if I went to my shop on Etsy and make sure guys that your shop on Etsy is ready they will ask you for a lot of things uh, it is not easy to create a shop on Etsy and I am assuming guys that you have already created an account on it and you have your shop ready because they will ask you on how you get paid we have to put your information your credit card etc you have to put your uh, id card you have to take a picture of yourself you have to do a lot of things so before you get to like uh integrate everything make sure that you are able to create an Etsy uh, shop at the first place we have already made a video about that so you can check it out later if you were interested on that and this is like literally about Etsy now here you might find the uh, Etsy to WooCommerce integration for free sometimes uh, here we have like some not very 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 good solutions but they can do the job for example here we have this Etsy importer so here we go it's the importer here we go importer it is stored product as post in a custom post type so it's not gonna be like product that it's gonna only be a post there is this basically it's a shop plugin that allow you to insert Etsy shop selection uh, sections in pages or posts using the bracket search code method and guys you could be really interested in other plugins that can be free so in this case this plugin which is Etsy integration for WooCommerce is about $20 so a lot of you guys will not be able to actually get it well there is a lot of solutions here if you were really interested well depending on what thing you would like to have exactly for example this is product lexer for Etsy so it is a branch of this plugin but it only gives you only one key feature so it will not have all the other features that the Etsy integration for WooCommerce normally has there is other things that you can look at them here there was like a description in here for example for each plugin you can take a look and using that you can decide on which plugin you will you want to go for or you will go for in the future depending on your budget and of course make sure to not only download any random plugin make sure that it has more than at least like more than three stars uh, more than thousand downloads and active installations and it has been updated like not like one year ago not like 11 months ago something around three months four months ago that will be good as a plugin and yeah guys that was the end for our video i hope you enjoyed it thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial